Hello and welcome to Bookends. I'm your host, Val Atmanavage. Uh, in this episode, we're going to talk with Frederick County Public Library's Community Outreach Manager, Brian Hassong. And Brian's going to fill us in on all the things the library is doing outside of the actual library branch building. That's very exciting. Uh, and we're also going to meet Tara Leberts, who's the Children's Bookmobile Manager. Um, so let's get started. Our overall goal is to bring the services, resources, and materials sort of beyond the confines of the building out into the community. So, for example, both bookmobiles, the Community Bookmobile and the Early Start Bookmobile, are within our department, and they go out into neighborhoods to serve, you know, areas that are underserved. So I drive the Early Start Bookmobile, and we work with organizations to bring literacy resources to kids around the county. We work with government-sponsored organizations, and we also um, go to ad organizations that work with at-risk children across the county. And we're bringing materials and resources to kids that probably don't have easy access to those from their homes. The other thing that we do is we focus on sort of big system-wide events. So like summer reading, we do that every summer. We sort of develop that and oversee that. Our annual um, author event, Frederick Reads, and um, the Celtic concert that uh, happens every March. We, uh, we do that as well. So as, as I mentioned, we have two bookmobiles. Uh, the one is the Early Start Bookmobile. And what that does is that visits um, youth and children who might not have the opportunity to be able to go to the library. We also have the Community Bookmobile, and that goes into both neighborhoods as well as um, older adult communities. They might not be able to, to be as mobile quite as they used to, so that serves those populations. Um, in addition, we also focus on building partnerships, whether it's uh, businesses in Frederick County or service organizations. So, for example, I mentioned um, Frederick Reeds. We partner with the Weinberg Center for the Arts, as well as Frederick Community College to bring that annual speaker series to Frederick every year. Um, our Youth Services Coordinator just met with the Parks and Rec Department to plan some fun and family-friendly activities, outdoor activities for the summer. So yeah, um, we also do outreach, which uh, is us going out into the community and, and, and talking about the services that we provide. One of our um, priorities in our strategic plan is building bridges. And, and what we saw is that, you know, not only do we want um, community members to come into our branches, but we want to go out to where they are to meet them, you know, at their spot and to meet their needs. And so we came to the conclusion that, you know, having one single department as, as a whole, we could better, you know, meet those needs and serve those uh, neighborhoods out into the community. I think that the need for bookmobiles is definitely growing. Uh, we have a wait list for both the Early Start Bookmobile and the Community Bookmobile waiting to be added for uh, to have their stops added and we I mean we could probably use another bookmobile because there's so many people who want the services. So we recently received some grant money from the state of Maryland. Um, we use it to purchase a book bike with uh, like an electric assist. So keep an eye out on the streets of Frederick um, for librarians riding around the neighborhood bringing books and services to areas where our larger vehicles uh, can't reach. We also um, will use that money probably in the next two years to purchase a, a smaller vehicle than the bookmobile, but a transit van. And that will have uh, a rolling bookshelf and a really strong Wi-Fi service that we can go into different neighborhoods, uh, roll those books out and, and, and meet people where they're at, sign them up for library cards, allow them to get access to Wi-Fi and they can check out books. As time goes by, we want there to be fewer and fewer areas in the county that the library doesn't touch. So, you know, when you're out on the street at a festival, an event, you know, keep an eye out for us, whether it's the bike or the transit van or the bookmobiles. And if you see the bookmobile, wave and say hi and, and uh, yeah, check out some books. Well, that was an interesting episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Again, for all things library related, visit us at fcpl.org and we'll see you in the aisles.